Tom back in a Guinness Pro 14 action this weekend. Connor away and Galway. Always a difficult place to go, and particularly when we go there needing a win to keep our Champions Cup hopes alive. Yeah, you know, so we need a, a positive week really to get the boys, uh, get them going again. And, and um, you know, training's been really positive and the boys are looking forward to it. It's easy to be downbeat at this stage of the season when you look at where we are on the league table, but fourth and sixth, extremely tight. And getting up that table into a Champions Cup qualification place is a very realistic proposition, particularly when you look at the teams that were above us. Blues, Connell, who we've got to play and, you know, to make a mark against. Yeah, I think, you know, the next four or five week block is, is massive for us. Um, you know, Champions Cup is where we want to be next year. We, you know, narrowly missed out in the quarterfinals this year and, um, you know, that's where we want to be. So uh, the next four weeks is going to be massive and hope we can get, get some points on the board. We've been around long enough now this time of the year when internationals go away and senior players in the environment have to step up, youngsters step up and... You know, it creates an interesting dynamic, but you're probably one of the older heads in the group now, and it, it yeah. probably changes the outlook for you a little bit. Yeah, it's always a challenge, you know, for people who be playing, which who don't normally play, and um, you know, we're lucky we got people like Rob McCusker and Sam Davis who will lead us from the front, and uh, hopefully I can do my part for that and um, you know, help the boys going forward. When you go to the sports ground, where you can guarantee it'll be windy, you guarantee mm. it'll be wet in some shape or form or description, so that's where. Halfbacks like you and Sam, you know, you can play a key role in the game, you know, driving the team forward. Yeah, I, I enjoy playing with Sam. I think we get we play really well together, get on really well, and um, you know, a book from him or, or Dan Evans to put us in the right areas, and then our forwards have been really dominant over the last few weeks. So hopefully, you can take that into the game. And then I know you're on a look one game at a time, but hopefully, we get the points in Connaught. Then we come home back to back games against the new South African teams in the Pro 14. So, I mean, an interesting experience for players, coaches, supporters alike. I think, you know, we, we should expect a lot of points against you know, South African teams. They like to play a bit of rugby, and hopefully, you know, the attributes we got in some of our players uh, make breaks from anywhere. So, um, you know, we're hoping for some points out of that game. And the Liberty Stadium pitch, despite the weather and the battering it's taken this year, it's still up there with the best rugby pitches you find anywhere in the Northern Hemisphere. So it probably suits what the South Africans have been used to traditionally mm. and the firm tracks and a running game. So despite being a Welsh winter, it's probably a game that there'll be a condition that they might be more familiar with than perhaps if they're going to some of the other grounds in the Pro 14. I think, but yeah, both teams will play positive rugby. Um, like I said, our, our forwards have been great over the last few weeks, so if we can dominate set piece, maybe get some penalties to push them back into their half and we'll come away with the tries. And I think it's a case of get these four games out of the way with Zebra at the start of March as well and then assess where we are in terms of the goal of finishing the Champions Cup spot. Yeah, um, you know, the, the next four weeks is, is going to be massive for us, like I said, and, um, you know, it's, it has been tough, you know, the last few weeks with a few changes going around camp, but it's been really positive and hopefully we can take that into the next few games.